hello good viewers uh, you're highly welcome uh, let's see how we are going to unveil the uh, solution to this problem I want to know what the value of x is so now we are having 1 over 1 minus roots 1 minus s square minus 1 over 1 plus root 1 minus s square equals root 3 over s squared so let's see how we are going to get the solution here so now what I'm going to do is that I'm going to see I'm going to take the LCM of both and denominators, this and this. So, and taking the LCM of this is going to be multiplying this and this together. So, we're going to have 1 minus 1 minus s squared, then 1 plus root 1 minus s squared. Right? So, now doing that, so you know that what we're going to do is, uh, when we divide everything here by this, so we're going to left with what this, right? So we're going to have 1 plus root 1 minus s squared, following. Then same thing here, minus into bracket. This, we cancel this here, you'll be left with this. We have 1 minus 1 minus s squared, right? close the bracket then equals root 3 over s squared so now let's move on so from there the next thing we are going to do is that let's try to open the brackets from the numerator 1 plus this we're going to have 1 plus 1 minus s squared then use this minus to open the bracket we're going to have 1 times minus uh, one, minus 1 times this we are going to have minus times 1 we have minus 1 then we have plus 1 minus s squared okay then divided by now here if you want to do the multiplication here want to do this multiplication here you should know that this is taking the form of a minus b then a plus b so where you are going to have it to be a square minus b square so that is what that is difference of two square so we are going to use it here so where one is a and b is everything here everything here is b so therefore what we're going to do is that just take one squared minus b is root of one minus s square all squared then equals root three divided by what s squared I following so now from there we move on we have 1 minus 1 there we go so plus root 1 minus s squared and this we're going to have in 2 root 1 minus s squared I following then divided by here we are going to be having 1 minus this square you cancel the square root we're going to have into bracket 1 minus s squared equals root 3 over what over s squared this is going to be 2 1 minus s squared over 1 minus minus times 1 we have minus 1 minus times minus we have plus s squared equals root 3 over what s squared i following so now from there what's the next thing we're going to do so you can see that 1 minus 1 that will give us what 0 so we are left with 2 square of 1 minus s squared then over what over s squared equals root 3 over what over s squared so now from here we can see that we are having s squared s squared common right so we can multiply both side by s squared so that this we cancel this and this we cancel this right so we are left with 2 1 minus s squared equals root 3 so now another thing is that we are having the square root here so we have to square the both sides so squaring the both sides like this so you see that this square we cancel the square root and it's going to affect this one we're going to have 2 here 4 into bracket 1 minus s squared equal this square we cancel the square root we have 3 i follow in so now from there so we're going to see that we can come like having open the bracket okay we have 4 times this time this we are going to be having minus 4 s squared right 
then transpose this 3 to this side minus 3 equals 0. Are you following? Or better still, we can say let's transpose this to the other side. We are going to have in 4x squared going to the other side. We are going to have in minus 4 going to the other side. We have plus 3 going back to the other side. We are going to have what? 0. So now from there we have 4x squared minus 1 equals 0. Are you following? So now from there, so we can see that from here, we can write this as 2x all squared minus 1 squared equals 0. So now 2 raised to power 2 will give us 4. x raised to power 2 will give me x squared. So this is different of 2 squared. a squared minus b squared is a plus b and a minus what? Minus b. So we are going to apply it here. We have x plus 1, 2x minus 1 equals 0. So it is either we said 2x plus 1 equals 0 or 2x minus 1 equals 0. So 2x will be minus 1, 2x will be 1 here. Divide both sides by 2, so we have x to be minus 1 over 2. And divide both sides by 2 here, we have x to be 1 over 2. So we have our solution to be x equals minus 1 over 2 and x equals 1 over 2. Do you understand? So this is the solution to the problem right so if you find the class very interesting so do not hesitate to follow so that you can see more of our amazing classes or subscribe rather hit on the bell icon so that you'll be notified anytime any moment we upload a new content thank you so much for watching bye bye